Hello and welcome back and today I want to give you guys a brief setup guide on how to set up Plex Media Server on your PS5. First thing you're going to need to do is get your PlayStation 5 all set up and logged in. Make sure you get your account set up and go ahead and log into the device like you can see. Now it's worth highlighting that you can't actually currently access servers over DLNA right now on the PS5. You can only utilize Plex Media Server in order to do this and this does assume this video that you've already got a NAS and set up Plex already. I've done lots of guides on that and you can find most of my guides in the playlist and I'll certainly link to one in the description below that will show you, show you how to set up a NAS with Plex Media Server independently which is something you're definitely going to need to do before proceeding with setting up Plex with your PS5. With the PS5 of course it will introduce its own multimedia apps down the line but right now Plex Media Server is the only way to really go about doing it Luckily you get all that metadata and background information as well to make it look a bit like Netflix and all the rest of those streaming services. It just means you can use your own media, but you will need an internet connection throughout the entire usage of that software. But without further ado, I've rabbited long enough, let's go into it. Go into the media tab and over to the applications. Scroll down. And amongst all of those third-party streaming applications, you will find the Plex Media Server app right there. Go ahead and download it. It is completely free. It's quite a small download. Um, it should be done pretty quickly there in the background. You're going to see that downloading tab shoot up there nice and quickly. And then after this, that Plex Media Server application will be available on the media tabs. You can go into it directly, but as you can see there, it's available on the PS5 XMB. Click X and you'll go into the Plex Media Server app. Now, the next thing you're going to need to do is associate Plex Media Server with your current NAS device. In order to set this device up with your existing Plex account, go into the sign in tab at the very top of the list there. That tab will allow you to log in and access this Plex client device, the PS5, with your existing Plex Media Server. Now head over to the URL on screen. On the right hand side of the screen now should be showing you my mobile. You can do it on a mobile or a desktop and from there go to plex.tv slash link. Log in with your pre-existing uh, Plex NAS credentials with that code and from there the screen will change as you can see here on screen and it will invite you to select the NAS on your Plex Media Server account. If you're sharing different NASs like I do or you have more than one server connected to your account select the one that you want to utilize as your default Plex Media Server NAS and this will be the media uh, collection that is accessible from the PlayStation 5. If you have multiple tabs for different directories like I have here that show different kinds of media, select the ones you want and then click continue to proceed ahead for the PS5 to access your library. As you can see here on screen, it has now access to my Plex Media Server NAS and I've already got all of the thumbnails already uh, scraped but metadata information is always readily available and Plex will scrape periodically. You can change the resolution, get all the information in the background, everything you want from a Plex Media Server NAS with the added benefit of course that this is all being done uh, with the NAS doing all of the hardware transcoding there in the background when you need it. Lots of information and all the configuration options are readily available and of course you can flick between PS5 and uh, Plex applications as well as updating and uploading footage to your Plex NAS remotely. But this has been how to set up Plex Media uh, client application to access your Plex Media Server NAS remotely on your PS5. Thank you so much for watching and stay tuned for more data related videos for PlayStation 5 soon. See you in a bit.